This is the number one court at London's Old Bailey. The case being tried here influenced the hanging laws of England. Timothy John Evans, the court has found you guilty of willful murder. And the sentence of the court... But what happens when you hang the wrong man on the evidence of a smooth-tongued liar whose pathological lust to kill shocked the world? You suffer death by hanging. <laughs> hanging. Hanging. His name, John Christie. His address, 10 Rillington Place, London, West 11. No, no, no. Breathe, Muriel. No. Take a no, deep no. breath no. and remember that what you see here really happened is factually based on official documents. You might well say, there, but for the grace of God, go I. No, we don't bloody My bloody house isn't it? I've got right to my own bloody house. Now then, now then, now then. We advise you to look at Christie closely. Very, very closely. For he lives again in the person of Richard Attenborough. Beryl! Another of his victims. Judy Jason takes you into this little back room, and you gasp for breath right alongside her. Don't let me hurt you! Please! This was the beginning of this man's end. You knew all about it, didn't you? Well, of course I knew about it. You're an accessory before the act. I done nothing. Oh, God, I done nothing. Simple, innocent, bragging, Timothy John Evans, hanging. If ever an actor was born to step into a dead man's shoes, Hanging. Sign there, lad. his name, John Hurt. If you don't know how to write your name, just put a cross. Get Christie. Get him here to see me. He's the only one who can help me now. If you saw him walking in the street, would you give him a second glance? Yet this man, Christie, killed. Not once, nor twice. Neither three times, nor four times, but five, six, and seven times did he kill. It all happened here, at 10 Rillington Place. Fantastic. Incredible. But true. Christie done it. Christie done it. Christie done it. <laughs>